Hey guys, I said I'm standing by back for another video today. We're gonna be making a Lego set. I already made a video of this yesterday. The Lego Star Wars Republic Gunship set 75182. It has it has 305 pieces. Comes with Clone Trooper Gunner, Ayla Secure, and two battle droids. So let's get building. Okay, so I just finished, as always, great set. So, it was a fun, like, I, took, I think it took about, like, 40 minutes to build. So, for the set itself, actually, no, let's start with the minifigures. Here we have Ayla Secure, a new one from the 2010 version. The, this one's more of a, like, um, this one's more of a sky blue than the, actually, no, this one's more of a, like a normal blue than the sky blue we got in the first one with the big with like the anime eyes and stuff like this one looks better and we have two battle droids we have the same function as you always do up and down head they can fold up into like a little ball if you wanted to have an existential crisis it comes with two of those with the blaster i really wish one day they update those instead of the stormtrooper mold from the new leaks, which is unfortunate. And here we have the Clone Trooper Gunner. I think this is like a zone idea of a, of a gunner for the Clone Trooper since he's not really, he doesn't really, like a phase one Clone Trooper Gunner, they appeared, but not this guy, I don't think. It is nice to have a new Clone Trooper mold. I just wish that, like this is my opinion, that they took out these two droids and just replaced them with another clone. And maybe made this set a tiny bit bigger and bumped it up to 30 bucks instead of 20 or however much it was, I don't remember. Also, it doesn't have the Top Gun like it did in the video, in, like it did in Battlefront 2, which is unfortunate. Still cool. It has wheels on the bottom. This would be a good set to, this is like a good, like, birthday present for, like, if you're in, like, if your friend likes Legos, this is a good, like, $20 Lego set to get them. Uh, hint, hint. Here we have the inside of the cockpit where you put the clone trooper. You can see it has like four studs and a seat to put them in. And on this side, we can see a control panel and a little handlebar to put to make it look like he's controlling it. Here's where we put up the rest of the stud shooters, which come right here. They're supposed to simulate this gun shooting, I think. Let me just shoot it down. You just press. I'm stuck on my ink brain. Sorry, I don't know how to fix the note. Stop doing that. Why must you do this to me? You just press this down and it shoots. Like a simple one. Has quite a few stickers. It has like six stickers, I think. Like one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. And on both sides of this 360 gun, you have a little clip to put something we have a chrome we have a chromey a chromey wrench and on this side we have a normal like a range blaster with a little technic pin on the back here we have these two antenna swords that are supposed to be antennas that's cool and it comes with an extra so that's so cool this thing opens up so yeah, great set. It like the minifigure selection is good. I just wish that instead of coming with the Jedi or something, it came with another clone or no battle droids, just two clones and a Jedi. I don't know. I just keep like this is a good army builder set if you want to build like a full scale battle or a certain stop motion or two and a one to two hour movie that you're making. I'm gonna stock up on these once I get more money. And my budget increases. 
And so, yeah. Oh, yeah, one more thing. There's a clone trooper's head. Anger clone. And, yeah. That's the end of this review. Next review is gonna come out... I don't know. So, yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. Bye. How do I...